I'm glad you guys made it to my channel. I'm gonna upload five videos for you today. Five motherfucking videos. The very first upload is of course gonna be Easy and Natalie. Y'all know I can't film without one of their videos, right? Y'all Easy and Natalie fans were going hard on me on my last video. I'm not gonna apologize, I'm not. It's just my opinion, you guys. And y'all didn't like what I said about Easy looking crazy. But to each its own. We're gonna go ahead and go to the next video that Easy and Natalie uploaded. This one is called, Finally Asked My Crush To Be With Me And This Happened. Before I watch the video, I wanna say, y'all know for damn sure Natalie's gonna say yes. Come on now. They're in love already. They're best friends already. Of course she's gonna wanna be with her. But let's go ahead and watch. Are y'all ready? Cause I am. Let's go. I wanted to ask you, um, I'm kind of nervous now. So you're about to marry me or what? <laughs> <laughs> no skips, okay? And don't drop timestamps in the comments. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and skip the intro so we can get straight to the question and the answer. Yeah, no. Best time ever. What y'all been doing? <laughs> I know she. I know. I miss you guys and I miss her. I miss you, girl. I miss you, girl. Oh, sorry. All the inches. Hair. <laughs> girl, you been using your hair products? Like, come on. Yeah. Growing. I'm jealous. I'm jealous. <laughs> So yeah, Easy is about to put in a couple like cute little braids in my hair. Um, Man, I got you, girl. Easy, you can braid. Okay, step vibes. I see you. I'm here for you. Know what I'm saying? I'm your best friend. You know? No. I mean, how many people say that? Girl, true. Thank you. Braid their hair. Bye. True. Oh, I got you. <laughs> <laughs> Comb. I didn't come out here thinking that I was gonna braid your hair, so we gotta be ghetto. If you ain't got a comb to part somebody's hair, get a pen. My scalp about to be looking dirty. <laughs> Thanks to you, I'm gonna be judged. No, you gonna be looking on fleek. See them clients that be talking while you doing the hair. Them, them be the annoying clients. You know what I'm saying? Like, girl, just get your hair done. Look, I'm paying a lot for this, so <laughs> I need to look right. <laughs> Okay, so right now we are at the spot. What is it called, Nana? Called bacon bitch. Bacon bitch. <laughs> bacon bitch. I've never been here before, but you've been here before. Yeah. So she said I had to bring her to the yeah. spot. To the spot. Oh, 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 so now our yes. food is ready. Our food is ready. We're having some breakfast right now. Yeah. Um, we got some coffee. We got our juice. We got everything. We got it all. We got to eat up. We got to enjoy. You know what I'm saying? Enjoy each other's company in my unit. Ooh, this looks good. Good. I should have got that. Put them on the basic. <laughs> Damn, easy. What the fuck was that? <laughs> I'm like an Natalie's dish. You say you should have got whatever I have, girl. So right now we're sitting on the beach, and Natalie, she's she's so freaking cute, man. I love her. <laughs> Um, you know, she was like, you know, let's go on the beach and like kind of like meditate and stuff. Tell, tell the people, let me know. You, you tell them. You tell right. them. So I just basically wanted to come out here and um, journal and meditate and really listen to like some self help stuff yes, and yes. just really like taking the vibe. There's not really anybody out here for anybody watching that are concerned about like our health or whatever. But yeah, it's just which I am, and that's why I gave Easy such a hard time for stalking her because mental health is so fucking important. And that's why she went to Miami to get that alone time to like deal with all that. But if you're able to do it with your partner's support, then I'm all for it. I just want your mental health to be good, Natalie. That's all, that's all, Nat Nat. Very nice vibe, you know? Looking good. Looking her little journal. My mom got me this for my birthday. Thank you, mom, I love this freaking journal. We out here trying to, you know, have a better relationship going into this. You know, we want to be healthy and not just like eating healthy, just spiritually. Good. Yeah, I know. So it's very therapeutic and I appreciate you and I love it because 
we've been practicing this like throughout this whole journey of this breakup and it's just helping us a lot we've been um like meditating together and journaling and even praying tell them about last night how you had a little moment Oh, life. yeah. Okay, so I had a moment <laughs> last night, y'all. Yeah, y'all. She did. She did. It wasn't like... It wasn't a was, blowout, yeah. but it was a moment where you felt like you kind of lost your... I was frustrated. Yeah, she had to basically bring me back to a zen space. I wish I recorded it, y'all. I felt so good about myself. Like, no, girl. Don't be recording everything. <laughs> like a cocky way but just like yo like i'm growing no I, I swear it was so shocking because i can be i'm not gonna lie i can be hard to deal with like when i'm upset guys <laughs> i ain't surprised crazy. <laughs> i wanted to say crazy oh my god but i will be just like okay no leave me alone like da -da -da -da, you know yeah. what I mean? she was able to calm me down and she was holding my hands and, and, and mm. what else what did i say that we should do like it was a mixture of my world versus your world yeah like, she was like um why don't we just pray and meditate and i was like okay let's try it so we took in a bunch of deep breaths, manifested the energy that we were trying to call onto ourselves. Okay. She also said a prayer and it helped so much, guys. Yeah. So. It just, it takes the right people to be in your life to really care and to really want you to be better and do better. So when you, when you go through those episodes of depression, anxiety, or any other type of mental illness, you're gonna go up and down a lot. And when you're down, you want the people around you to be patient, to be understanding. You don't even have to say a word. Just your comfort alone, your physical presence speaks a lot more louder than words. And from what it looks like, Easy was there for her, for Nat Nat, when she had her little episode. So, by all means, man, Easy, keep doing it. It helps so much. I went from feeling very triggered and frustrated mm -hmm. to just feeling zen. And then we went Good. and grabbed some food. Grab some food. Yeah. Just hung out. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we are trying. <laughs> what does that mean? What is that? Hold on. Let me rewind that real quick. What did you guys think that meant? Let's watch that again. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. And frustrated mm -hmm. to just feeling zen, and then we went and mm -hmm. grabbed some food. Grab some food. Yeah. Just hung out. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we are trying. To <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Were they trying to tell us that they messed around? Y'all know what I mean when I say mess around. What y'all think? I don't know. I think they're keeping a secret from us. Incorporate more right. peace and serenity right. into the relationship. Exactly. So, Manifestation and, you know, just jotting down our ideas and problems and emotions. It's very therapeutic. And let me see. Let me talk to me again. I was saying that to say, to bring that up, Natalie, because you know, I know that you practice this a lot and I know you're starting to show it, especially on your channel, yeah. you know? I just okay. wanted to say, look, if anybody's going through it, if you watching this video right now are going through it just personally or if you're in a relationship and you guys are both going through it, all you guys do is argue. All you guys do is you just can't stand each other. You love each other, but you're just too comfortable, you know? Practice meditation. And meditation isn't just like something where you have a buddha in front of you you know what i'm saying it's not just that meditation can just be whatever your definition you can of meditate meditation. wherever you are exactly too. like it can be you can meditate in the car uh -huh. wherever you are if you are feeling overwhelmed with emotion right stop drop and meditate right <laughs> period period poo you know what i'm saying it's very peaceful you're peaceful <laughs> um yo but Side note, look at what Natalie is wearing. I am going to cash out one of you, the first person though, that can guess where her outfit is from. I got the white line, uh -uh. Mm -mm. Sorry y'all, sorry, I had the, you know, the chapstick white line, but so if you guys can guess where her bikini is from, cash out the first person that gets it right. Ready? I don't and know. Go. I don't fucking know. <laughs> Get, okay so i don't know i'm not a water person i know nothing about bathing suits and shit i'm gonna enjoy this meditation when you're casting put your cash app name oh yeah put your cash app name and remember we're not gonna ask you to send us money to be entered into this random giveaway for this cash app oh my god we're gonna do not get scammed y'all be getting scam scam let's finish this meditation
Uh oh, the romantic vibes happening. Look, we have the beach to ourselves. The beach to ourselves. Nobody on the beach. This is the perfect time to come. Mm -hmm. Early, early in the morning or late, late. We still got our masks on though, cause you know, gotta be safe. Time to be safe. Better safe than sorry. Better safe than sorry. So after being in Miami for a week and some change, I felt like since the energy has been so beautiful between Natalie and I, oh my god, here we go. I couldn't help but ask Natalie if she wanted to come back to California with me. Oh, so that's what you mean when you asked her to finally be with you? Oh, girl. This was some of the conversation. Oh, y'all ain't gonna show us? Y'all just gonna give us audio and shit? Oh, hell no. Y'all got us in black this whole time? You could have at least put a picture of you two together. So I guess we'll just listen. So I want to ask you something. I know you're sleeping, but I kind of want to talk to you. <laughs> Can you talk to me now? Get up? No, oh, talk to me now. <laughs> she said, bitch, I'm trying to sleep. Can we talk about this shit later? <laughs> can see their faces. Body language, facial expressions, tell it all. It tells you more than what a person is saying. So I really wish I could see them. Come on, Nana. You said literally out of your mouth said that you didn't need no more space and you had enough space for a lifetime. So come back home with me. I don't I'm ready for that. I mean, I know I'm ready. You know, I'm ready to pursue you. I'm ready to start this, you know, try to pursue the relationship and only if you're nat nat only if you're ready nat nat don't feel pressured to go back let's start this relationship you said let's start this relationship what does that mean exactly so are you not only asking her to come back to Cali with you? Are you also asking her to be with you in a relationship? Uh, can, you, can you please be more in detail? Oh, here we go. So we talked about everything and although she had an amazing time with me in Miami, Natalie wanted to make sure we both understood the importance of space and communication. Yes, Nat Nat. Yes. Okay. I like that, I like that. So I decided to give her a few days to think about coming back home with me because I knew it was a lot to ask and did not want to rush her. Okay? Be patient, Easy. be patient. And after a few days of thinking, this was her decision. Okay, this was a few more days. Of course. <laughs> of course that's gonna happen. Now let's hope that she continues her self-work because we all want her to be healthy, including you, right, Easy? I hope so. Let's not be selfish now. I know you really want to be with her, but don't be selfish. Times like these, you have to put her first. So 
soon in the day I'm ready to go home, but I'm ready to get off this plane. We are on our way back to California in a day. I think I want to do something, something special for Madeline. You know what I'm saying? I really, really want to do something special. I don't think that's a human or not, but I really want to do something special for Madeline. And, um, what you going to do? Romantic, you know, in our, in our friendship, with Aldo, I've always been romantic. You know, I got I want to do some promise now. I'm going to do something. Um, so I kind of just, you know, need you guys' help. So I need you guys' help to not tell uh, Madeline what's going on, okay? You put a huge thumbs up right like, now. Uh, going back to Cali so we'll see what happens next my neck is hurting y'all I am so sorry for touching my neck throughout the video but it hurts anyways you guys make sure you like comment share and subscribe and please hit that bell so you can get notified every time I upload and don't forget I'm uploading four more videos after this stay motherfucking tuned all right you guys see you in the next video peace